So I'm up at about 7 in the morning and I start out feeding everybody. Everyone gets their grain, they get their hay, they get their alfalfa. While they're eating, we clean up the pens, clean up the, the poop piles, fill the water. Uh, that usually takes me about two, two and a half hours. During, during the midday, I'm usually working on fleece products. And the equipment over there, making our own products from the fleece, washing the fleece, carding, spinning into yarn. Again, at four o'clock in the afternoon, I start the whole morning regimen over again, feeding, cleaning, watering. In the evening, we go out to the pens and relax with the alpacas and watch them play, and that's our day. It's, a, it's all in what you put into it. So to have a very successful farm, marketing is very, very important. We're not looking to get rich off of alpacas by any means because we are such a small farm. So as long as we can make enough money to feed, for them to feed themselves, we're happy. We do do farm tours and we have a farm store where we sell alpaca products and, and we do pretty well doing that. So it's all in what you put into it. And we're a fairly new farm, so this is the first year we've started working with our fleece. So these guys came into the country first in 19, the late 1980s, and um, I saw a commercial on TV about owning alpacas and just fell in love with their faces. So I was working at a laboratory on the base and was very stressed out and we got our daughter married and out of college and I told my husband, I was like, let's do this. So um, we purchased our first two and um, that was in 2011 and we boarded them um, at another farm for a couple of months and within two years, this is what we had. <laughs> I drive the truck, I haul the hay, and I shovel the poo. He also helps me with our herd health procedures. So we trim teeth and toenails, but that's only done every couple months. Um, our worst experience? Probably last week. <laughs> we had we have tours, so we have people that come out, and I had just finished telling them that our alpacas don't spit at people, and we grabbed one of our best males, and he spit right in his face. Oh, no. So that's probably our worst experience we've had. Okay. Um, not a whole lot of bad experiences with these guys. They're very enjoyable. Probably their demeanor is the best thing for us. It, it is a business for us, so that's probably the, the, the best one. But just calming animals. Just we love being around them. Very gentle, very curious. They're just, they're just a fabulous animal to be around.